Welcome to this time of weekly reflection in both word and song. And thank you for joining us for this time. I hope that this season, as we work together on this inside out journey, is meaningful and reflective for you and for the community around you. Let us pray. Holy One, we are so constantly bombarded with temptations and enticements. When we yield, when we fail, who will help us? You, Lord. You, Lord, have come to our aid. You teach us, counsel us, and guide us in the ways we should go. And we rejoice in your unfailing love. Amen. Our reading today is from Psalm 32. Blessed is the one whose transgressions are forgiven, whose sins are covered. Blessed is the one whose sin the Lord does not count against them, and in whose spirit is no deceit. When I kept silent, my bones wasted away through my groaning all day long. For day and night your hand was heavy on me. My strength was sapped as in the heat of summer. Then I acknowledged my sin to you and did not cover up my iniquity. I said, I will confess my transgressions to the Lord and you forgave the guilt of my sin. Therefore, let all the faithful pray to you while you may be found. Surely the rising of the mighty waters will not reach them. You are my hiding place. You will protect me from trouble and surround me with songs of deliverance. I will instruct you and teach you in the way you should go. I will counsel you with my loving eye on you. Do not be like the horse or the mule, which have no understanding, but must be controlled by bit and bridle, or they will not come to you. Many are the woes of the wicked, but the Lord's unfailing love surrounds the one who trusts in him. Rejoice in the Lord and be glad. You righteous sing, all you who are upright in heart. Greetings on this Lent 2023. The first hymn that we've picked is Lord Who Throughout These 40 Days. And if you have a hymnal at home, it's 269. And it tells the story of Jesus's struggle with Satan and our hopes for the journey of these next 40 days. The tune that's in the Methodist hymnal, unlike a few other hymnals, is a U.S. folk melody. Um, if you have other hymnals or explore the internet, you can go hear the other versions, but in our hymnal, we have a folk tune from way back in our history. Ten. 
sense, and through thy passion tide, yea, ever in life and death, Jesus with us abide. Abide with us that so this life of suffering overpassed, and Easter of unending joy we may Thank you for making this weekly reflection time part of your prayer and reflection discipline. As you move from this place, may you be held by God's gift of grace, the gift that lives now and reigns within us. We're free. We are forgiven. We are alive in Christ. Go now in peace.